So amazingly, this is the first sort of, uh, well, perhaps not first, but thus far only three episodes in the most is probably the word, uh, mainstream film we've done. Well, it's got it's actual actor. It's also, yeah. I was going to say actors, but actor. Mm. Yes, this has this has famous actor in it. This film. <laughs> Singular. Didn't he do like over over two hundred movies or something like this? Is no one going to tell him there's a skeleton behind him? Like he's going to shit bricks if he turns yeah, around. Yeah, that's pretty pretty fucking spooky. So I mean, it used to be a magical skeleton. The skeleton has such like a, a, a cocky kind of look about it as well. He knows what he's doing. Ah, I see you're getting paid the big dough there. If yeah, I had yeah, that kind of money, I'd buy me a nose. You, you might actually be on something. Someone might have just pushed it into frame. <laughs> it's just like, oh, I bet it's going to be really funny. And the, and the director's like, take, that was perfect. Like, oh shit, I'm going to keep it in. <laughs> okay, boys, I am very reb sighted today because this will be the first reb episode of the show we've done. We, where a film stars legendary Herculean actor Reb Brown. And also some guy called Christopher Lee. Yeah. Unfortunately, we were so excited we didn't wait till February, so it will be Reb Tember. No, no, wait, wait, Reb Tem- Reb Tember. That yeah. works. Reb Tember. Oh my god, let's go, boys. Why? We could have waited Basically, a month. Basically, I'm just Reb Tober. I'm, I'm adding the, the prefix Reb to a number of words. <laughs> if this becomes a running gag in the episode, I apologise. I'm hoping I forget to do it sometime halfway through the film. Well, well there's so. look, with quite a few beers. Yeah, we've got a pyramid. Mr. Of... Bean in the middle there. Uh, <laughs> 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 It kind of looks like him. Oh, it right? does. Like, if he's <laughs> through a beard. It's uncanny. <laughs> Why did Christopher Lee do, decide to do this film? Uh, Money? Jay, I, I actually know. Um, so he decided to do this film because he'd never made a werewolf movie. That's literally it. <laughs> oh, like, I've I, done a bunch of drug yeah, shit. genuinely. He was like, I feel like I should do a werewolf. I need to branch out. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I want to break typecasting by doing a werewolf. Well, yeah. He rings his little bell and he's like, Butler man who makes my movies? Uh, yes, Cast me the, me a agent, the butler man, movie. bring me a werewolf script. Okay, which. Anyone! And then he burns a giant man in the. Uh, burns a policeman alive in a wicker basket. Yeah, wicker, wicker basket. Wicker, wicker basket, yeah. yeah. That's the cheap. I was going to say, that, that's that's the uh, Bruno Mattei knockoff, yeah. right? Uh, the, wicker <laughs> the wicker basket! <laughs> Uh, Bruno Matteo. That's a name I expect to hear a lot on this show. Um, we are only three episodes deep in a new series, but I f- I'm already predicting some of the places this show is going to take us. <laughs> By the way, I apologize. Look at the size of Reb. Whoa! <laughs> the guy is intact. Can, 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 no can, can we get? Can we get? Can we get the smallest? Cow? Cow? Can we get a child and a small old woman to emphasize this? That guy is a fucking tank. What the? F- I, I swear the only reason he's in this film because he's you know he's not a he's Whoa. not look at him the only reason he's in this film is because they needed a leading man who could look Christopher Lee in the eye and they didn't have the filmmaking skills to like dig a ditch. <laughs> so, <laughs> like, so if I remember for what I can drag up like so this is the this is a sequel and like the at the end of the first film the woman turned into a werewolf on screen but yeah. everyone's gotten it and she looks nothing like she did. Yeah, because it was D. Wallace in the mm. first one, and obviously D. Wallace wasn't going to come back to a Red Brown movie to play a corpse, right? That's just not going to happen. Why? <laughs> Sorry, did you take a shit and you had to bury it? What the fuck was that? <laughs> He's just a giant. Look at him. What do you know about the death of Karen White? Do you want to get another, <laughs> yeah, to say, another, another take? Or? All right, so we've done the practice round. Uh, yeah, okay. Do you right, wanna, is that how you're going to do the yeah. line on okay, the Okay, so I've memorised my line. So when do we want to do the actual take? Oh, that is the actual take. Can we do it again, please? Imagine that being like your first uh, major bit of dialogue in the film and you just fuck it up <laughs> that badly. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> ah, Reb, reliable as always. Yeah. I mean, he, he's not screaming, so... He's... <laughs> <laughs> Where oh, this you'll be is it's looking no, super slick. N- no one will notice you're an old man. He's wearing the same glasses as that guy. No That's what, yeah, nice. exactly. That in fact, nice. he's probably going to beat that guy up, take his place to infiltrate the gang. Well, yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it's, take it's, his sunglasses. Yeah, it's, it's, <laughs> it's, 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 it's also the Hitman movie. Yeah. See how seamlessly he blends in, <laughs> like a Fuck fucking chameleon. Me. Fuck me, dude. I know this isn't what we normally do on this show. We normally just take the piss, but I actually have some interesting trivia about this scene. So this film is not shot in LA, despite it saying Los Angeles at the beginning. So this is like communist, I want to say Bulgaria or maybe Czechoslovakia. Oh. But um, basically it's, uh, it's uh, either communist country or recently, recently no longer communist. Mm-hmm. But basically, 
they weren't allowed to have this many people in one location, so the police came and had to break, uh, basically send everyone home in groups of no more than four. <laughs> <laughs> just walk out and slowly like evacuate the set. That's so funny. Oh, uh, get used to this song, by the way, boys. Hopefully it won't get copyright claimed. Yeah. This, this, the this, po this, boys. This, 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 the um... Saying the Poo Boys. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, it's it's a sandwich. Yeah. So does this song about <laughs> Pale Moon? Cha that's a chain of sandwich shops. Hang on. <laughs> I meant to say in the Pale in, in the Po Po Boys, <laughs> the Po Po Boys in Ramsgate. <laughs> Is there a Po Boys here? There should be. So. Yeah. Great. Does All this right, song have some sort of thematic theme with the rest of the film? It may do, but more importantly, it's about Po Boys. <laughs> And there aren't enough of them in Kent, so let's... <laughs> let me... <laughs> the fucking shirt tucked into the jeans. Why is this Simon crazy? Cowell looking ass. Do you reckon he goes there every night? Is that his nightly haunt? Yeah, it has nothing to do yeah. with the... It's not actually investigating shit, he's just there to hang out. I'm here to pick up honeys. <laughs> Fly honeys. My wingman has mugged me off again. <laughs> My wingman, Peter Cushing. <laughs> but I don't know why he wouldn't want to pick up chicks. <laughs> Big Butch Peter Cushing. What's this Peter Cushing slander? Yeah. So wasn't he married and everything? I was just... <laughs> <laughs> like, he, he just came off of that sort of person. I was just picturing like, just Christopher Lee just telling people <laughs> Peter Cushing was gay. <laughs> <laughs> I, know. I mean, we say that about Toby all the time. It might be that what they do is a... Fuck you. You're my friend, Peter Cushing. Yes. He like he's a bit of a mm, or a bit of a <laughs> I say like isn't he married? Well, I mean yes. Oscar but... Wilde was married. <laughs> what a great reaction! You just Ow! took a glass bottle to the head. Ow! I want whatever stimulants that guy's on, where you can just take a bottle to the skull and walk <laughs> so around. Look like a shit like a pixie dust. <laughs> You know that thing that reminded me of um, that Star Trek episode where the barrel falls on Worf and cripples him, yeah. despite it being the lightest thing in the world. I just saw the cameraman's shadow. Oh, oh, this movie's terrible now. Oh yeah, up until then it was good. Yeah. It's one of those movies where the tone doesn't really work because you can tell it's like trying to be somewhat funny at times. Mm -hmm. Like it isn't taking itself super seriously. So, but you're not really laughing with it. You know, you're kind of laughing at it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What is what do these shots of Tina Turner have to do with anything? <laughs> Why are there like special effects masks in this guy's house? He's meant to be like a, a cultist, like werewolf hunter type, right? He's basically playing Van Helsing instead of Dracula in this yeah. movie. So why has he got like special effects makeup in there? He's got a swimming pool in the background. What a dude! <laughs> That's what, what I'm looking at. Sorry, I'm just looking at a swimming pool or a little. I reckon that's just I Christopher Lee's right real house. Yes. Yeah. Oh my god, imagine. This is like, I don't imagine. They didn't actually. Uh, Chris, it's, they didn't realise. Like, this is just Christopher Lee. Like, I just want to show you my house, my anti werewolf collection. You like, see that's You see that right next to my collection, my swimming pool? Yeah. Numbers of werewolves living secretly among us. <laughs> oh, fuck, my <laughs> sense of humour is broken. <laughs> I, I love <laughs> the fact that <laughs> among us has been ruined as an actual <laughs> phrase. <laughs> Amongst us. Yeah, I was gonna say I've taken to saying amongst us now because of that. Like, it's too suspicious, you know. Quite sus, one might say. Halt! This is the fucking yeah. You said the mask in the background. It's like you walk, you look, you walk into the house, you sorry. sit down, see that, and just leave. There was what? There was no um. There, there yeah, was, why is it a fucking yeah. But yeah, there wasn't a movie set available. We just got to chill at fucking Greg Nicotero's crib. Like, what? How, what's it... happening? Are these supposed to be werewolves that he's decapitated himself? Why did he take the fucking whole torso? I don't. I, I don't these are just some what, busts. Yeah, so. I don't know what the context is for those. I do like. Yeah, you know, okay. We've, we've just discovered where, like, where a small time uh, news room. We've just discovered werewolves. Let's bury this. Like, no, I want a fucking Pulitzer. Yeah. News so, 11, yeah, werewolves! Yeah, let's, let's, let's cover this up. Like, absolutely not. We're journalists. We have no integrity whatsoever. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like one of those, uh, like, it's like... It's not like it's a paedophile ring. They're not going to cover yeah. it up. Transformations have already begun. So, so this is great dialogue. Here, listen to this. Evolution is reversed. The process of evolution is reversed. Now... 
again, there's some funny oh, trivia nice. about this and why that line is in there. It's very, it's a very bad line of dialogue. Mm -hmm. You know, even uh, even by the standards of, of this Lord, sort of this sort Remember of movie. when people evolved from wolves? Um, so that's the thing. The wolf cycle in this is very uh, gorilla-like. The many of the wolves you're going to notice as we go along look like monkeys. And there's a reason for that. It wasn't in the script originally, hence that line being shoehorned in there. It was actually Christopher Lee's idea to say that line because uh, they got a crate of the wells, uh, and it's a copyright 20th Century Fox Planet of the Apes. <laughs> and they've been sent a bunch of ape suits, <laughs> not wolf suits. Oh, okay. And they had to make do. Only Christi oh. Christopher Lee, got, like, God bless him, apparently did not have a lot of fun making this movie. <laughs> What's really thrilling to me about this film is that this is not. It's not that Christopher Lee is in this film with Red Brown. It's that this is Christopher Lee's second film with Red Brown. That's what's so fascinating to me. <laughs> and the first Everybody was... gets one chance, right? But how do you get two chances as Red Brown <laughs> <laughs> to make a film with Christopher fucking Lee? The first one was Captain America 2. Oh, but fucking brilliant. that was... Uh, I forgot there was two of those Captain America movies. <laughs> Yes, it begins! <laughs> I really think they should have made it more ridiculous. Like, he has, like, a rotary shotgun or something like that. It's Just... alright, we've got Strike Commando for that sort yeah. of thing. <laughs> Christopher Today. Lee is about to stake a werewolf like she's a vampire. <laughs> yeah, but, but hang on a shut second. Shut up, shut up! Damn it. Listen to him, Ben, he knows what he's talking about! About my sister, he does it. That's clearly... I love that that... Like weirdly shrill scream is basically Red Brown's catchphrase. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like Arnie had "I'll be back." Yeah. Why? And Red Brown had. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what? he looks so apey. Okay, yeah. but my question here for you, Jacob, is this: Why is this werewolf wearing clothes and the rest weren't? Sometimes you like to let it hang Tell around. Me, let... <laughs> you know I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> like, like. The rest of them, all they strip off of this guy's. He's all right. Like he, he's got like good. He's material. trying to bring. That's just you an see, old guy. Yeah, do you want to see an old wrinkly <laughs> real <laughs> dick just really deformed? That's what I'm gonna look like in 50 <laughs> years' fucking time. It's it's just, Christopher Lee just comes doesn't wear a stir, but it's just the groundskeeper. <laughs> it's just really ugly. It's like I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Sir, please, just has a heart attack. The heat's good. It's a bit long, but it's, it's a bit long. Yeah, but it's a banging film. You've got this three hours. Much better than. Why does that one look so less spooky than the first one that was behind his back? It looks like a cartoon! Ah yes, to Transylvania. Famous for its werewolves. <laughs> and, and shitty fucking skeletons! What I the fuck does that look like? I refuse Why to believe. Why did they statue the I first one? I refuse to believe there is a church in Transylvania with a little bell ringing skeleton yeah, on it. That's so at least funny. Uh, okay, that's unlikely, and it's definitely statue. not one that looks like a like it's out of a Halloween store. Right, that's song count number three, boys. The sound oh. producer turned up, and they only got one record. They thought, oh fuck it, well, look, we've only got a limited time. Let's do this shit. Let's make a film, right, where the only song is Return of the Mac. Can we, can we three oh make God. that happen? Like, just... We just cut to different parts of it. Like it's a drama or something like yeah, that. Yeah, the only song that ever plays is Return of the Mac. <laughs> it's weird seeing like something shot on film in real locations mm. and stuff. Because on this show, we're used to doing things by Vitaly Versace or <laughs> Neil Breed. This looks like they spent money on it. Yeah. I mean, not a lot of money, but, but more than uh, both of our films combined. I'm so yeah. fucking glad that I haven't been. That's just footage of Christopher Lee falling asleep in yeah. the back of the car. That's There's ridiculous. no way that's acting. Wait, <laughs> uh, only way it could have been silly is it. What the fuck? I had a fucking like, beer in my throat and just like. What was that fucking Elden Ring looking character? <laughs> what the fuck? There he is as well! Hey, fellas, I know this is such a played out meme now, but you know, when your custom character appears in the cut. Literally! That's what it just looked like. I don't know how much of this we can show. I'm pretty sure there's nudity in this scene. How much do you reckon the extras who had their tits out were paid? Not a fucking thing. This is a communist country. They weren't oh, allowed to accept money. <laughs> they got half a roll of bread, which the government promptly took. <laughs> yeah, as it, harsh as that sounds, it's, it's fucking co believable. It's communism. <laughs> So they were they were let out from the work camp for an afternoon. Stop We're gonna have to censor you otherwise. Please do not take your get. Oh no! It was just like, yeah, they just left her to die because they're communists. She is weak. She can't pull plow. Christopher yeah. Lee, stop killing people! 
<laughs> Someone has to. Red Brown's way lazy in this movie. <laughs> Bingo. <laughs> someone, someone give Red Brown an axe or something, or a shotgun, or a shotgun axe. Wait, so Christopher Lee just leaving the movie. <laughs> I must go now. I'm going to the village. I'm going to get a drink. We could. We're going to the village as well. We're all here to investigate the Transylvanian werewolves, okay? Yes, someone edited him from this film into Resident Evil Village. <laughs> Do you seriously think, though, that there is there is some ground... <laughs> Where? Where? Well, werewolf! And also, that werewolf ain't going to be dead if they ain't silver bullets. Oh, no, these are European werewolves. Silver is quite useless against them. <laughs> oh! It's food that they're weak against. Oh, okay. Because they're so unused to it. Sorry to say, I know it's going to get cut, but Eastern European porn looks a bit shit these days, doesn't it? <laughs> to be fair, that is the average amount of um, hair. I on, like, know. I was, I was thinking, like, it just looks like boss man from yeah, the kebab. I was just thinking, this is literally, I was about to say, most well-groomed Greek. <laughs> <laughs> I hate anything where it's like, oh, 666. It's so cliche. It's not even accurate. Well. Like, so what, this building has six over... That's vampires! <laughs> this is a fucking um, vampire movie! Uh, yeah, you've got the wrong... Don't be reacting to garlic no, like I mean, that, you're I mean, a vampire. To be, to be entirely fair, garlic is supposed to be something that, that does one yeah. of evil spirits, but yeah, fucking pull the other one, it's vampires. Look at the size of him. He crushes her. Look at his yeah. arms. They should call him Trend Brown. Would you like to be crushed in Red Brown's arms? Would you I, like to be held and comforted? So I'm not remotely attracted <laughs> to Red Brown, anyway. but I... I just admire him in a really weird way. You, you like, weird not, to I want to be him, is what it is. <laughs> yeah, me and you, Reb. Me and you too, Reb. You just seem like a seething ball of emotions right yeah. now, Reb, I have to say. How old is your gun, Reb, if you have to do that with it? Fuck me. Oh, I think Reb just has a bunch of guns just to play with, like a fidget spinner. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll tell you what. <laughs> yeah. It's just what Rush Roulette yeah. fidget Okay, that, there's no way Reb was told to do that. No director would say, Reb, dance like this. <laughs> the fucking pipe! Sorry. The size of his pipe! It's just like a, a bunch of nuns and orphans walking past. <laughs> and like, wait, 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 it's not what you think. He's talking about his cock. He's a pervert! <laughs> I just wanted I just, you didn't walk just through the guy. Every shot, this so fucking red, mountain. Red, did you not even fucking like yeah. notice Christopher yeah. Lee there? Yeah, he just, I just like it. Like he's just walking forward, and the guy, you know, he walked around. He should have walked through, him and the guy just exploded. Where's like ben? wood chuck. Sorry, just look for the fucking boulder that's moving around. I say, where, how do you lose Red Brown? I was like, look for a fridge wearing double <laughs> denim. <laughs> like, where's Ben? That outfit is fucking iconic. Look at that. If somebody asked me... To, she looks like a Mortal Kombat character. If somebody asked me... Div the shoulder. Devise, devise a costume that perfectly encapsulates the idea of camp, it would be this. Fucking That great. is incredible. That is so cool. Look at I, the, I don't even want to call... Like, I'm the, not uh, even making fun of it. I love this costume. I don't um, even want to call the... Um, gender like, swap uh, Sub-Zero. Yeah. No, but like the, the bits frost. of the legs... Mm. Where yeah. it comes up like I don't know what like, you call the, yeah. call the bits that are sticking out there. at the top. Yeah, yeah. It's like it's like she's Sorry, got a giant head scorpion was basically yeah. the same character. It's, yeah, it's sort of shooting up the yeah the legs. It's like building a giant. It looks like that was difficult. That sitting down motion yeah. looks. It looks like a difficult. What I just wear. want to say yeah. about this is that it's the full moon festival, and yet they, they have crescent moons all over the place. Mm. I, 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 what? Blessed earwax. Sorry, who the fuck is this small guy? It's part Why of are it, they trusting him with it's, his life? It's, it's, it's part, part of, of like the uh, crew. murder crew. Oh, I went to it in the church. Yeah, he's one of Christopher Lee's boys. Okay. You just didn't notice because you're pissed. <laughs> I've had like one beer and like half a glass. Of, no, you can lightweight. Fuck off. That looked like you for a second there, Matt Rat Brown. This bat just like starts weeping. Are you okay? That's the nicest thing you've ever said to me in ten years. <laughs> Surely, I'm sorry. If I was that guy, let's I saw go. This guy, <laughs> what the fuck, man? Yes, please hit him in his most armored location. Yeah. You got to flail, right? You've got this huge target. Hit him in the one place he's wearing armor. So, in case you missed it, because we are talking shit, she just said that Christopher Lee is her brother. What? Now he's human. Right? And she's like a thousand years old. How the fuck does that work? 
Maybe Christopher Lee is also not a werewolf, but also a werewolf. But in Stop turns out that like, like, he's just he's just an immortal from Highlander. It's the crossover they never told you about. They could be taking place in the same universe. To be fair, this is better than some Highlander movies. I mean, most of the Highlander movies. Yeah, all of the Highlander movies except the first one. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Short buddy. Okay, Reb, help him out. Help him out, Reb. Reb, find the earplugs. For Reb, God's help him sake. out. Reb. A bit more urgently than that, Red. Red, come on. It's, it's not, your you're not looking down. for some change for a drink. Red, put your pistol down. What are you doing, son? Red! He's, he's about to die. Okay. He's just incapable of giving <laughs> a shit in any scene. He's trying to figure out how to open his hand. <laughs> he's like, I wasn't thinking. He's just thinking about what craft services he's serving for lunch. <laughs> he, can't, he, can't, he, can't, he can't hear him. He's trying to like guess. Like, Also, go, going back to like just her outfit. Yeah, like, you, well, that's where she sat down. You know what I said Whoa. earlier? <laughs> About the perfect image of camp? Yeah. That, that, all <laughs> this. Oh. All, wow. Oh. She suddenly turned into Emperor Palpatine. Yeah. Unlimited uh, more power. More like Rita Repulsa, I think. Also, are the other two wearing earplugs? Or is yeah. it just Red Brown? <laughs> Whoa! Holy shit, I know I'm taking the piss out of this movie for a while, but that was metal as fuck! <laughs> That is by far so, the coolest so, moment of this okay, film. So I Holy this shit! This bit, but I love that his is, eyes just went is this guy, flying out. Is this guy head. a vampire or just a rapey dude? I love that you keep saying vampire. Oh, shock horror! It was the dwarf. Who knew? That was the. <laughs> that was the worst attempt. <laughs> oh my god! There is. <laughs> there it is. There is a movie where Red Brown. Saves Christopher Lee by, from a dwarf by, by throwing him out of a window. <laughs> that's that's <laughs> fucking great. And also, what I love the fact is that the pit of spikes he went into was absolutely intentionally just for him. Yeah, that, it, it, it was like, along to the it fucking was, building. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't oh, like along the fence. You shut the fuck up. Rep just goes. I found Sturmer's castle. What was it missing? <laughs> How do you lose a castle? What do you mean you found it? It was in Manchester. Yeah, so you, you can see why uh, the director was very pissed off when the werewolf suits arrived. Why like Christopher Lee, ever the professional, tried to sell them. Yeah, like, fuck, yeah, you're right, fucking go go hack my. That, how great would it be if they were literally Sasquatches and they had nothing to do with the werewolf plot? Oh my god, yeah, they just found <laughs> there was just a, There was just a Sasquatch attack in yeah. the middle of this fucking werewolf. It's fucking movie. like the fucking Dark Stalkers, the live action movie. Fucking, it's like Finding Bigfoot. That show is the funniest fucking show I've ever seen, by the way. Finding Bigfoot. I, I love, it went on for nine seasons and they never found him. What, what the fuck? What they, what, oh, spoil it for everyone! <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, that's atmospheric. Oh, I wonder if there's a werewolf down there. Why? Yeah, I was going to say, how long are they going to fucking no, it was a Sasquatch. patch of grass? <laughs> oh, do you, do, you think, do you think that guy's going to survive to the end? Yeah. Um, <laughs> he, he takes the, out Sturba. The character whose name I can't remember is absolutely <laughs> going to kill the villain here. That would be so great. It's a weird acting that's climax. That's such a Rian Johnson way of making a werewolf <laughs> movie. He could have just said, I'm for But, uh, that would have been better. <laughs> Surprise, Red Brown! <laughs> oh no, his cax rock! Cut short! I love the Red! He's way too big for the doorway! <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna duck to get in! <laughs> Did he? I, didn't, I missed that, that's so funny. He like ducked in! <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. Oh bless him. See, <laughs> now, now it, tells, it doesn't even sound like she's their brother and sister. She's like, come, you know, my beloved Stefan. No, Hang on a second, like, what? It's like they're in love in this scene. So it's, it's sort of are they brother and sister or are they lovers? Like are what? they both immortal it's things? It's so or? unclear. Oh, does Christopher Lee die? And he does give birth to oh, an alien. Uh, yeah, so you can't show that. Yeah. What? what? So that was a penis after so, all. So yeah, so there's at least two sex scenes in this film. I don't know. That is just so inappropriate. Do you do requests? Um, excuse me. I'm like, I don't think you need to pull a gun on him to ask I'm like, question. Why? What? Also, why did you ask the musicians? Of all the people at that festival to be local, the musicians are the least likely. Mm. 
And also, are we just doing streaming? Oh. It's literally just that direction. Just oh. keep walking in and that also, direction, Rab. I feel like you probably know They're where... They're back the... in fucking LA! Yeah, Rick, I I hang on, boys. I Sorry. feel like Reb already knows the way to the airport, considering he came from America. You know, they're supposed oh to be back in America, God. right? Yeah. It's, it's just, it just all looks like Europe. Do you know it's, it's an apartment. Really How does it still look like Europe? Oh yeah, that thick American accent. Dun 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 dun. Fuck you, man! We have gone through the entire fucking film. We had a pyramid of beers right there. Shut up! Right, while the film's about to end. Again. Fuck you! Right? We got through fucking hour twenty nine. How much of this? Shit. Cool. How many of this can we actually use? It's just Toby screaming. Yeah, he's going here screeching. And well, maybe you can put a warning at the beginning of the video that what? Toby is loud. Okay. You know it's not even that you're loud, it's no, your high pitched and specimen, loud. He's a specimen bat cave punk, right? That's what he just wrote. Did he just make a wanker word. sign with the microphone? I think he did. Was that and that was at us, right? That, that was at the that was at the times. audience. Yes. That, that was that was directed straight at the audience. Fuck this you, movie, Rick this movie is just a big troll. Fuck you, Rick Astley. Speaking of which, we could have watched Troll 2 instead. But yeah, this is as a, if that would have been a better experience. 